Hello everyone, and welcome back to ASMR Horror. I'm just kidding. This is The Devil and Me Part 3. We just killed Aaron. Well, I just killed Aaron. I don't know how I feel about that, but nonetheless, we continue. Thank you for joining me. Where the hell is she? She's got to be around here somewhere. She has to be. Yeah, I'm sure there's a simple explanation. This place is like a maze. She's just turned around somewhere and... And screaming her ass off? You all heard her. Something bad has happened. You don't know that. Bullshit. You just don't want to let the shoot go, Charles. I, on the other hand, have no problem with that. Something is very not right here. Let's just find Aaron and get the hell off this island. Everyone relax, okay? Just give me a second to think. Excuse you. <laughs> Bye. And exit stage left, our oh-so-confident and sure leader. What was that? <laughs> Ooh. Charlie is thinking, which looks a lot like a temper tantrum. Maybe he's right. If we don't crush this episode, we're all screwed. Are you kidding me? What? I'm just I've saying. I've been waiting on you for ages to actually make a decision about something. Anything. And now this is when you suddenly choose to take a stand? Whoa. Way to air all that out, Kate. So the show is more important than the fat Aaron is missing? No way, Mark. Come on. We find her and we leave. You're jumping to conclusions. Mark, I don't know what's made the two of you suddenly swap perspectives, but Kate is right. If the show goes down, we're all screwed. Yeah, don't care. I'm going to find Aaron. Right. Here's the plan. We've already got a plan. It's leaving. Just listen. Look, let's just crack on with things. I'm going to go and find Dumet and square everything with him. He's I'm not thinking there. after standing us up for dinner, I can guilt him into doing an interview. So Erin is on her own? She'll show up. Bravo, Charles. Your delusions make for such great plans. Dumet left. I saw it, remember? Maybe he's back now. Maybe he's not. Would it kill you to think positively just once? I guess as far as Charlie ideas go, it's not the worst he's ever had. It's not even the worst idea I've had this evening. Don't go patting yourself on the back. I still think your priorities are fucked. Whatever. I'm going. I'm coming with you. We're gonna run around looking for Demet. Maybe we'll find Aaron too. I don't care what he says. I'm done. I'm getting my shit together. Kate. I'm leaving, Mark. You coming or not? Yeah, absolutely. Mm. Okay, genius. Where are we going to look first for Dumet? I'm not looking for Dumet. I'm scouting for shots. If he pops up along the way, great. Aaron has disappeared. How can you not care about that? I can care about more than one thing at a time. Wow. You know, working this job has made me really understand what a sociopath is. Well, our show is educational. <sighs> Asshole. Okay, now that we got that cutscene through, I... I have questions about everyone's motives, everyone's priorities. I already read this, right? Uh, Grantham Dumet, yeah, it's a Morello. Um, questions about priorities. I'm also wondering kind of how the motion capture is done. Did they just get a big model of their body and their face and just kind of digitally put it in? Uh, the reason I ask that is some of the animations are a little bit janky. It looks beautiful as a whole, but I don't know. Uh, that being said... I don't think I can go anywhere but downstairs, huh? What is the count up to now? 181. 100% this thing right here is counting the amount of people that died in this hotel. Aaron just got added to it. Damn. I feel really, really kind of bad about that. <laughs> like, is... Is there a way I can go back to the chapters and... What happened here? We're not going to. I... No idea. Boy, this place is all torn up, isn't it? We have a note here. And it is the script. Why 
is the script here Aaron, on the floor? Can you hear me? Can you warn me before you start shouting? It is a fear point. Uh, blood. We have blood on the ground. Or jelly. Um, I'm starting to freak out. not gonna go in there looked. yet. Yeah, but she's been gone a long time now. Aaron! For all we know, she and Thu met Okay, well, Charlie's fun is up next. Wonderful. Well, maybe, actually, I have no idea. Cured. Hmm. That does not help me at all. Given what I saw with Aaron, I saw her die twice, actually. Wait, what? Wait, what, what? What the hell? What the hell, what? I'm gonna turn this light on. Can I turn this light on? Uh, yeah. Huh? No power. I thought you took care of this. Um, you want to talk about what you were talking about here? You said what? What do you mean, what? Uh, has this changed at all? No, it is not. I would like to know what you were wedding. Okay, well, through this bloody... Trail we go. Jamie, over here. Okay, yeah, I'm freaking the fuck out. It's just blood. Just blood? Are you kidding me? You're jumping to conclusions. You're or not. Maybe this is from Aaron. Stop it. You always assume the worst. All we know is something was dragged along this way and it was bleeding. And that's not a cause for concern to you? All right, it's a little odd. Odd? What do you want me to say? Look, it's probably just Dumet or the groundskeeper dragging in some dead animal from outside. Maybe it's our dinner. <laughs> I don't think so, bud. Um, yeah. <laughs> uh, is that a camera up there? Welcome, one and all, to tonight's entertainment. Oh, what the fuck? Presented by Grantham Dumet. Dumet? What? So he hasn't left? Mmm. -hmm. I don't know about that. Later time. Did the... I just heard something. I don't know what, though. Hmm... really dark up this way. All right, boys and girls, we have a choice to make. Right or left? Left looks a little more well lit, so I'm going to go right. Makes sense, right? I would be jogging, but I don't want to miss any secrets. Ooh. Uh, it looks like a government logo. FBI, as a matter of fact. Ah. I first met Agent Monday on October 12th, 1997 at O'Hare Airport when I was assigned to welcome him off the plane. I'd actually met him once before at a lecture on criminal behavior given a few weeks prior here in Chicago, but I doubt he remembered me from that. I was pretty nervous as the new kid on the block. I was just out of training, and I'd been assigned to drive around this big shot criminal profiler who just cracked the Arkansas case, which was all over the national newspapers. My first impressions were that he was tall. Okay. Surprisingly, that didn't last that long. I thought that was going to be a longer one. Ooh. Is that a coin? I believe it is. Yeah, I still haven't gotten to a part where I can actually use these on something. I keep thinking like it's going to be like a shop or, or something. Okay. So nothing that way.
I'm just going to say it now. This is the best out of the dark pictures so far, I think. Ugh. Lovely. Mm. Can't do anything with the bloody glove. I can just look at it. Excuse me. Yeah, it sounds like someone is getting tortured in there. I believe that's all we can look at here, other than this door. Uh, I know what that means. It means move to another area. That happened with Aaron. Why not? Help! Oh, you hear that? Please. Help! The uh, fuck? Help me! Please! Please! Are you... I don't do anything! What happened? Are you okay? Oh! What the fuck? Stop! Look! Jesus. It's a fucking booby trap. You shift your weight off that plate and... This guy is getting run through by that thing. Hello. Help. Please. Help. Help me. Join me. Uh, stay. I know that seems silly, but... Oh! Like I said, I know that seems silly to stay there, but... Did, did you see him? The mask? What the hell was that? But I think it was the better of the two options. Oh, you're shitting me. Now we're trapped. We're trapped. Jesus. We're trapped. What do we do? Break the fucking door down. Right. On three. One, two, three. Uh, uh, uh. My controller is vibrating is like happening? crazy. Things are moving, shifting. Fuck. <sighs> Find your spirit crystal? Don't do that. And don't make fun of me. Sorry. Wouldn't want you to cut yourself. The rock is sharp as hell and, you know, super magical. It's an amethyst crystal. It helps keep you calm by blanketing you in protective energy. I know. I remember. If you know, then don't call it a rock. Maybe I just feel like you should take responsibility of your own emotions and stop outsourcing the job to a crystal. Mm. Maybe you're right. But you don't have to be an asshole about it. Ooh. Okay, maybe that was a shitty thing to say. I'm sorry. It's fine. This isn't the time or place to... I have to tell you something. Okay. Earlier, you brought up that DP job I blew off. I never told you the truth about it. About what? It wasn't a job, not really. 
What are you talking about? Remember my friend Murray? He was setting up a studio in Brooklyn, Fine Arts. He wanted a partner. <laughs> That's your dream. Yeah. There is exactly zero money to made, so I thought you'd tell me it was insane, rightfully. Because it would be. Mm. Why the hell didn't you go for it? Why didn't you tell me? Things were already starting to get tough for us. Oh, no, no, no. Don't put any of this on me. This is all you. I know. I turned it down because it would have taken me away from you. But didn't you break up with her? I guess I didn't even think of that. I... I just... Uh, what do you want me to say? Guess I was holding out for things to change with us. Deep down, I'm still hoping. Mark, I have never once shied away from telling you where my priorities were. All right. I get it. We better go. Let's find Aaron and get the fuck out of here. Okay. I don't think I had a choice in that relationship I don't care. I'm more interested in finding Aaron, which I'm sure Charles is not concerned with. Why do you call him that? What? Charles? Because he hates it, obviously. Wonder how much pure amethyst is going for online these days. I don't know. How much is it going for? Okay. Now we get to explore around a little. I enjoy these parts. The cutscenes are movie-esque. I do enjoy that, but it's a little dominant in this game. Uh, so far, at least. Anything else Who's to look Who's going into? around locking these doors? You met this uh, little helper in the yellow coat. Wait, how did you know about that? I guess you saw him from one of the windows. Okay, that's also locked. Uh, locked. Locked. No, it wasn't. I thought it was shining. Wait. What's that? Is this somebody's idea of a fucking joke? How is this here? Did you bring this? No. Is that her? Yeah. Her? Shelby. Uh, okay. Matching nails? God, don't. We always got them done the same. That's him. What? That's him. The guy in the back. You know him? He kind of did. He was just one of those guys that was always around. We would be at some of the same parties, but that's it. It was my fault. You know that's not true. The night it happened, I was supposed to meet her. We were going to grab some drinks, go to a party. I slept through. It was a big deal on campus not to go out on your own. And Shelby waited for me when I didn't show, and that's when they, that's when he got her. It's okay. It's not fucking okay. It can't be. I have to live with it every day, and now someone knows. Someone wanted me to find this. What the hell is that? I have no idea. But I feel like it's bad. What the hell? Get over here, now! Charlie! I can't hold this. You have to get the fuck out any way you can. Just get the fuck out! Now! Now you're telling her to do Jamie! that. Jamie! Charlie! 
What the hell just happened? I, I don't know, but I think it's really, really bad. It isn't moving. So now what? We're fucked. That has to be a way around. Yeah, maintenance corridors, crawl space, has to be. Ah, I forgot you have a flashlight. Much more practical. <gasps> uh, What's going on? Uh, he's funneling you into a very certain area. You Matt, are being controlled. What the hell is going on with him? He was nervous the whole way here. I chalked it up to him just being eccentric. There's a lot of miles between eccentric and murderous. Okay. Let's think about this. You saw Dumet take off. Yeah. So maybe he found out there was a killer and bugged out? Maybe. Or perhaps the man we met wasn't actually Dumet. And the dude in the mask is? Hmm. That contraption, that's a hell of a lot to set up. That was planned out, every bit of it. It was set up for us to find. Which makes it even more likely the dude on the ferry wasn't really the Met. Yeah. Yeah, that ends up. Okay. You know, I wonder if this actually is a sprawling map and... I know in the cutscenes it shows like things moving, like this place boarding up or uh, whatever I'm trying to say. But I wonder if it is a sprawling map and it's just kind of like controllable. I'd be curious what a developer version of this would be like. Where you can just wander around and hit a button to open up corridors or something. Uh, maybe we'll get to do that towards the end of the game. Yeah, I know the door is shining there, but I need to find coins that I don't know what to do with, you know? Okay, that doesn't make any sense. Is this just a closet or something? Mother yeah. fucker. Mm -hmm. What? Brick wall. Keep going. Just like Holmes. I know, I don't want to think about it. I mean, if you looked at the architecture, you can kind of figure that out. Um, no. Okay, well. Trying to map this in my head. But I think Erin's room has been completely cut off. Jesus, Charlie. Why is he messing with her? Because she's the most easily frightened. The most vulnerable. Don't you watch our show? That's what these sociopaths do. Oh, what the fuck? Is that a kid? Oh, good. You hear a creepy kid voice too. I was worried I was finally snapping. Where's it coming from? Mm, okay, sorry about that. Well, I found another coin. Up to 18 so far. I wonder how many I missed. I feel like I haven't missed many. I feel like I'm looking around quite a bit. Charlie, come here. No going Let's back now. <clears throat> Why didn't you try that in any of the other doors? Would you go in there? <laughs> you asked for that. We're in a bloody nesting doll. What? A Russian nesting doll. You know? 
a doll in a doll in a doll. Are you losing your shit? Because I don't need that right now. We're locked in a kitchen, trapped in a hotel, stranded on an island. Even if we get out of this room... How do we get out of the hotel? Exactly. Mm. Or off the island. Maybe we just focus on one thing at a time. This room first. You're right, of course. Yeah, I don't buy that exit there for a minute. Uh, this looks like a body. Morello. Natalie Morello. Oh, are you... Oh, fuck! Holy shit! It, it's a fucking body! You think? Meet the last party that visited this hotel. You don't know that. Maybe it's... Fuck. You're probably right. Uh, yeah. I am. Charlie, I found a way out, maybe. Look, this one swings out. We can probably force it easier than the others. Stand back. That's not what I was expecting. Ah, Jamie! Ah! Ah! Uh oh. Uh -oh. Charlie? Fuck. And now we've moved on Charlie? to Mark. Jamie? Hello? Aaron? Keep it down. Where could she be? She can't have just vanished. Mark, come over here. What is going on? <laughs> are, are we locked in here? Looks like it, yeah. Wait. Shh. What? Shh. You hear that? Is that them? Where's it coming from? Somebody's in the restaurant. What's the plan, Charlie? You end up dead. Oh, that's us. Toast. All of you. Really? I know that I'm the butt of your jokes, and that's just my cross to bear as the patriarch of our little family. Wow. Mark and Jamie, the two of you do the work of a team of ten. And Kate, despite our bickering, you are the heart of this show. You keep people interested. What the fuck is this? Mark, what are you doing? Just stay back from it. So, it's a bunch of mannequins dressed like us. Weird? Yes. Cause to lose shit? No. Unless they can move. Investigate the mannequins. Hmm. Has mm. anyone seen Mr. Dumet? That's kind of weird how they're just talking randomly of stuff we just said earlier. Hmm. Okay, this is fucked up. What the hell is going on? Hmm. Do you just want me to look at each one of these? Like, how how did how did they get the jewelry? That's that's what I want to know. Is she wearing the same necklace? Where where are you, Kate? Come here. Let me see something. Uh, yeah, same necklace. How? How is that possible? Oh, poor it. Oh, poor Ellie. Jesus. It looks just like him. No way somebody just threw these together in the last couple of hours. I wonder whether they do this for all of the people. Hmm. You hear that? Footsteps. And they're getting closer. But Watch out. Why would he invite us here and to dinner and then just leave? Uh oh. Oh! <laughs> 
Ooh. Oh shit. Sorry. Jamie. What's going on? Sorry, I thought. Jesus. What are those things? Uh, I have to find oh my god. When that wall shut, I. I'm just glad you're okay. Demet killed his groundskeeper. What? Right in front of us. Demet. Oh, that's who that was. It's a setup. He was wearing a mask, and I know how that sounds, but I'm not joking, and now he's after Aaron, so we need to move. Yeah, about that. Wait, hang on. Where's Charlie? I don't know. We got separated. No way this is happening. You know, so when our bodies wash up on the other side Are of you the fucking lake, kidding me? Bodies dead. Jesus, dead. shut bodies it up! Bodies dead. Dead. What was that? This... It's fake. A prop, or from an animal or something. It has to be. No, 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 no way. Oh, don't grab it from there. Oh! Oh, it's real! It's fucking real! I told you! This was all too much! Let's get out of here. What's going on? The door I came through is locked too. You mad? You wanna play around? Ooh, Get I wouldn't do that. Right now. Let's fucking play. Yeah. Poke the bear. Where's Charlie? Oh, Charlie's down there. Okay. Uh. It's like a puzzle. You're gonna make me work for it. Oh shit! Oh god. That's not good. There's a flame in there. Mm. Cage key. All right, now you're just messing with me. So take note. There is a flame inside of there, which means that can ignite something. Jamie! Can I climb up there? Hello! Maybe? No? Jamie! I'm okay! She moved on, bro. Okay. Um, is there anything else in here? Uh, all of this feels like a trap. I don't want to burn alive. of people what is this Chicago killer victim one cause of death abdominal injuries victim's ear is removed by a severely sharp object possibly scalpel whoa John Doe number two I'm assuming you brought my report on the first one Similar MO, unidentified male with multiple stab wounds. Looking at the lower abdomen, the wounds are consistent with those of the first victim. The shape of the entry wound suggests it's a strong probability that this is the same murder weapon. Looks like we've got a souvenir hunter here. 
This time the left ear has been severed. Clean incision. Probably a scalpel or a razor blade. Very tidy. Nice job, actually. Very little bleeding. The deceased had probably been dead for 30 to 40 minutes when this was done. This differs from the earlier MO. If you remember, that John Doe was still alive when the teeth were removed. That would have created a lot of noise and mess. This guy is learning. Mm. So you started out as someone different, maybe? I'm starting to see why there's uh, been so many comments about true crime. I think it's because of this. Things like this. The story behind it. Um, as I've said, I, I am looking for an excuse to kind of get into it. Maybe by the end of this, I will. Kitty Cooper, logbook. Can I open that up? Yes, I can. All right. Um, most of the crew have arrived at the island, moved all the equipment up to the hotel, met with the proprietor, Mr. Belknap. On site assessment has begun. I'm going to read it over here. Uh, excavation has begun in the hotel basement. Uh, ineligible. Illegible, sorry. Uh, work on the first and second floor is going as expected. Some equipment has gone missing. Filed a report and requested replacements via your contract. James Kelly has left the project. Left a note citing an emergency. Didn't contact me directly. Written report to follow. <coughs> Excuse me. First set of moving walls has been implemented. Acquired a copy of the blueprints from Mr. Belknap. Uh, tomorrow, a lot of it is illegible uh, towards the end there. Hmm. What? What the hell was that? What was that? Hmm. Okay. So we have another cage door here. I'm afraid if I do this, it's going to start a fire. <laughs> and I'm afraid to start a fire. Uh, looks like there's a switch in there. Three different lights that are red. Examine. Power out. Do I want to turn the power back on? What other choice do I have? Lights are off. That gate opened. That's still open. Mm. Hey, why can I look at this again? keep having this feeling that I'm going to end up in here. Pretty much since the premonition I saw about burning a life. Um, yeah. <laughs> uh, uh. Okay, so there's a power thing. We have another door here. Just trying not to get killed. That's all. Open. Can I burn that rope? I have a lighter. I dropped the lighter. Oh, I dropped the lighter in that room upstairs, didn't I? Right? No, wasn't it back here? I thought it fell on the floor down here. Uh, apparently not. Apparently I was mistaken. I just don't want to die, man. That's, <laughs> that's all I care about. If 
Anyway, so the connection is severed right here. So there's no way that's going to power anything. This power line goes to this door. I don't think I can open that up. So I think I'm safe to do this one. Right? Yeah. I mean, clearly all of this is just a big ass trap. Uh, what is this thing? Is this like a people? Indeed it is. For what though? Do I have to find something and drop that back in there? Okay, so we have another power box, which you can follow it on the wall, goes to this door as well as over here. Around up and over to to this one. So this one closed because I opened the other one. So far, it's been pretty linear progress. <coughs> wow, excuse me. Linear progression uh, through this part. I'm wondering what the variable is. Like, what can I do to change this? Can I squeeze in between there? I think you want me to do that. I don't know if I should, though, or not. Um, yeah. I don't see anything else, so. here. Ooh. Do I have my card still? Will I need it? Yes, I need it. So, I do still have it. Drop my lighter. Uh, but I kept the card. No, oh, it's just a coin. Okay. Well, I'll take it, I guess. They have to be wondering, like, okay, what the fuck are these coins? <laughs> it's fine. Alright. God, I wish your body wasn't taking up half the screen here. Like, it's cinematic and all, I get that, but I can't really see sometimes. Alright, so this one goes all the way around here to there and then it just kind of disappears behind all of this. Boy, I got a bad feeling about this one. Fire. No, hold on. Oh, no. Oh, no. So am I going to have to run? Run back and flip those switches? But then where do I go? Does it burn that little... Mm. See, here's... Here's my concern, is back there, there was a wire that was cut. So it wouldn't have opened that door anyways. That's why I was wrapped around by a piece of rope. But I need some type of fire to get through there. I feel like I could easily die here. All right, I'm going to have to make a break for it after this. screaming. Ah. 
Maybe I'm overthinking this puzzle, but I don't know. Wait, I hear gas. Is that gas or electric? So that thing is dropped now. But can I move any of these switches? No, I can't. Well, you clearly burnt off. Like, I, I see that now. I don't want to go in that damn room. I can't go in there. Can't go in there, and I don't see anything else other than the fact to go inside of this room, which I'm probably going to get trapped in. But there's something over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, cigarettes, come on. Well, hello, gorgeous. No. Where have you been all my life? No. Praise the Lord. It's real. I swear to God, Charlie, if you light that. This is going to be the best cigarette of your life. You don't have your lighter. Something just opened. Hmm, bartender's gone. And that door is open now. Praise the Lord. What's he doing? Use a stick, man. There's the gas. out of his hands.
Couldn't have forced open that door, right? Do, <laughs> God. Do I not have a choice in saving anyone, or am I Things just making to terrible decisions? Charlie's goose may be cooked. It can be difficult working with someone you've been involved with. I'm I'm confused because that door was clearly locked. Could I have forced that door? Not only that, the premonition that I saw looked like he was burning near the door. That's why I didn't choose that one. Ah, this is kind of frustrating. Mm, continuing. But I think Mark and Kate maybe finding a way and learning some new things about each other. And how do we feel about Mr. Dumet's lovely animatronics? I think they're rather clever. Some of them look very realistic. I wonder where he sources the parts. It would only be fair at this stage to offer up a little hint to even the odds. What do you think? Uh, yeah, I'll take it. Yes. Let's take some inspiration from the works of Sir Arthur Conan Doyle. Apparently, our friend Herman Mudgett was so enamored with Sherlock Holmes that he borrowed his surname. Hmm. Here. <clears throat> he has a brain of the first order. He sits motionless like a spider in the center of its web. But that web has a thousand radiations and he knows well every quiver of each of them. I hope that helps. No, it doesn't at all. I'm kind of miffed. <coughs> I've killed two people. I feel terrible about that. You'd better get back to things. What? Best of luck. Back to killing people? <laughs> That's what you want me to do? Oh, okay. Saved him. What do you mean you could have saved him? That's a big control board. Wow. Shit. What? <laughs> what the fuck? Wait. You hear that? Yeah. From down there. What if it's Aaron? No way. Damn it's it. another trap. It's the only way out of here. So we're going to find out. Mm -hmm. We are going to find out in another episode. Um, I don't know. Maybe I'm doing something wrong. Maybe, maybe I'm not choosing the right things. Maybe they're all supposed to die, and that's part of the story. But I can't believe that in a Dark Pictures game. Um, I, I'm not going to spoil it for anyone. Um and and hopefully you don't spoil it for yourselves maybe i'm just playing terribly and for that i'm sorry but nonetheless thank you for watching i will leave it there and say until next time <laughs>